Hi there, my name's Steve Parker, and I'm a volunteer radio station engineer at a hospital radio station. I've also spent the last 15 or so years working for a company recording dialogue for computer games. I'll explain why that's relevant in a sec. This is an overview of a project to provide an alternative to voice tracking a radio show. The idea for this project came about from the difficulty of finding radio presenters to fill the schedule at the station where I volunteer. The question was, could we come up with an app to play cuts of presenter audio so it sounded like the presenter was alive? Now we're not talking basic voice tracking here, we're talking friendly phrases that play randomly based on whether it's morning, afternoon or evening, time checks, current weather, artist names of the songs being played, and anything else we could think of. All sequenced so it sounds like a smooth link. Now, there's obviously a limit to how this will work, and we're talking about short 20 second or so presenter links here. We're not going to go into deep analysis of every song with the link. The computer games business link is of course that game dialogue is planned in a way that short phrases in a game can be concatenated or joined together in a planned way. So the phrases sound like a proper paragraph and the same phrase doesn't get played too often. To plan the dialogue, there are dialogue planning programs used in the games industry or you can just use an Excel or Google spreadsheet. So I started out with a Google Sheet and tried to plan how each presenter link might work. The general sequence of a link would be to back announce the artist's name for the song just played, maybe have a time check, station name, a quick greeting phrase, and then announce the artist for the song coming up. There might be special sequences for a top of the hour link and the end of the hour into the news and other sequences to promote other shows on the station. A basic weather forecast would be great and if we've got all the artist names recorded we could do a tease sequence for songs coming up on the show. The way I'd see the program working in real life would be as an add-on module to the station's automation software so the artist names could easily be pulled from the automation log and these voice sequences are programmed into the clocks just like regular voice links. But just to see how it would work I thought I'd design a prototype layout in the style of a cart wall. Now I've been playing with a software application called Live Code which I can highly recommend if you want to get into doing some programming. And Live Code exports a Mac, a PC and a Linux executable of the program, so it makes things very easy. From some of the early experiments with assembling different phrases, it quickly became apparent that there's a style of delivery that you don't hear in regular conversation, but you do hear on the radio. And this style does actually suit this project. It probably defies most English grammar rules and I wonder if it's come from DJs trying to talk over song intros and hit the vocals. Presenters tend to have this stock set of very short phrases that get used again and again. It means dropping all the little sentence joining words and sticking to standalone phrases. I'll try and explain. So I could say, Good morning, it's Steve Parker here on Radio Mount Vernon. The time's coming up to 20 minutes past 10 and we've got some fantastic hit music coming your way this morning on the show. Next up, we're going to play a great song from Ed Sheeran. But if we break up the sentence and try to add a different artist's name, for example, the joins won't sound natural. If we're trying to concatenate phrases and make the joins sound natural, it needs to be more in this style. Good morning, Steve Parker here. Radio Mount Vernon, 1025, Tuesday afternoon. Next up, a great track, Ed Sheeran. Now, at this point, I should add that I haven't presented a radio show since doing student radio in the 90s, but you probably guessed that already. So 
So the idea of writing this program initially is more to find out whether this concept will even work as an idea, whether it will sound even vaguely natural, or if it will just come out like some interactive phone line. The number you require is 02076302031. You get the idea. Let me show you how far I've got at the moment and you can make up your own mind whether it works or not. So I've recorded a load of stock phrases for time checks, artist names, song outro phrases and song intro phrases. There's also some weather related audio and a load of different show titles so we can promote other shows on the station's schedule. What I've done, as I was saying earlier, is a cart wall style layout where each button on the cart wall plays a different sequence of audio. For this concept version, the artist names for the song just played and the song coming up have to be chosen manually and the same for the years and the same for the music tease section. But of course, if it was part of the station's automation system, this information would be automatically available. Just to show how it works, let's choose Hadaway from 1992 and Ed Sheeran from 2017. And for the music tease, we'll choose Gabrielle, J. Giles Band and Kaiser Chiefs. Slightly strange music policy on this station, but never mind. Then, when I hit one of the sequence keys, I get the relevant audio. Radio Mount Vernon, Hadaway, from 1992 to 46, 9th of October, afternoon time here. Can we sneak in a little siesta, do you think? Will anyone notice a sneaky Tuesday kip? Staying with the great music now, Ed Sheeran. And... Here's a music tease. 246, songs coming up. Stay tuned for Gabrielle, Jay Giles Band and Kaiser Chiefs. All coming up. We've got weather. Hadaway, how's the weather shaping up? Well, top temperature today, 21 degrees C. And the overnight low, 8 degrees C. Tomorrow's high, 23 degrees C. And tomorrow's overnight low, 10 degrees C. Sunrise today, quarter past seven. Sunset today, 6.22. Who's on next then? From 2017, Ed Sheeran. And we can promote other shows on the station. You're listening to Radio Mount Vernon. A big Tuesday welcome to you this afternoon. Go on, put your feet up and enjoy the Tuesday tunes. All through the week, we've got loads of great shows here. Let's have a look. Tuesday evening at 8, catch Tuesday requests. Make sure you tune in then. Staying with the great music now, from 2017, Ed Sheeran. There's some specific audio related to the music genre and also the different decades. I don't have to change the artist and year to show you that, but it makes more sense. So we've got a 70s disco song coming up, for example. Hadaway on Radio Mount Vernon. A warm welcome along. Hope your Tuesday afternoon's going well. Dancing Shoes on next. We've got a classic disco tune for you from 1972. Chic. Or a song from the 80s, perhaps. Hadaway from 1992. You're listening to Radio Mount Vernon, 9th of October 2018. A big Tuesday welcome to you this afternoon. Go on, put your feet up and enjoy the Tuesday tunes. We're going to dig out an 80s classic next. Remember this? From 1982, The Human League on Radio Mount Vernon. So you get the idea. Next, I'll show you the preset page. This is where you design the links. At the top here, I've got buttons related to general audio, and then these blue buttons are station-specific audio. So the idea here is I choose a preset. The presets relate to the cart wall buttons. 
and then I just add elements to make up the link. So let's redesign number nine here. I want a this is station name, first of all, a song outro phrase, and that automatically drops in a previous artist and year, but I can take out those if I don't want them. Then a music tease phrase, and then a general music intro, and that also adds in a year and the next artist. I'll take out the year just to show. I don't want that. Then we save the preset and let's hear that sequence. This is Radio Mount Vernon. Love that one. Hadaway from 1992. Songs coming up. We've got Gabrielle, Jay Giles Band and Kaiser Chiefs and loads more too. What should we play next? The Human League. What's also quite interesting, perhaps if you're a presenter who voice tracks on multiple stations, once you've recorded your base set of audio, all the time, the dates and the artists, to add another station is a very minimal amount of audio. I've made an example here. If I switch stations to KISS FM, all my station specific audio switches to KISS FM. I've got some variations of the station name, so it's not always the same one being played. And there's also the website, the email, the phone number, but all that only amounts to about 25 audio files. So as a presenter, you could license your voice to be used by various stations and then just sit at home with your feet up. <laughs> Let's hear the KISS FM audio. Kiss FM Portugal, Hadaway, from 1992. Eight minutes to three, 9th of October. A warm welcome along. Hope your Tuesday afternoon's going well. Stand by for a great song, The Human League. I'll just show you the other pages for the station schedule and the weather page. So here you've got up to 10 slots to drop in show titles and times to promote other shows on the station. When a schedule button is pressed on the cart wall page, the program just chooses a random show to promote. You're listening to Radio Mount Vernon. Afternoon time here. Can we sneak in a little siesta, do you think? Will anyone notice a sneaky Tuesday kip? Right, loads of great shows all through the week here. Let's have a look at the schedule. Thursday evening at 8, you can hear Thursday requests. Make sure you tune in then. On with the tunes from 1985, The Human League. Here's the weather page. I'm pulling an RSS feed from the BBC. There's a lot more data here that I don't have recorded audio for, but I don't want to put the poor listener to sleep. By the way, the BBC feed is great for temperatures and other numeric data, but what I'd love to find is an RSS feed that uses a standard set of weather description phrases that I could record. So if you know of one, please let me know in the comments. Also, if you've got any other ideas of data that could be turned into audio, let me know. I was thinking about currency exchange values, or maybe even the number of car park spaces left in the local car park if that data is available online. Anyway, thanks for watching. Let me know if this might be something your radio station might find useful. Uh, let me know if you've got any other ideas or if you're a radio automation company and want to make this into an add-on module, let's talk. Finally, here's a few more examples of some different sequences. Six minutes to three. A whole brand new hour of freshly chosen music to come. Look out, here comes the Human League. Hadaway, six minutes to three on Radio Mount Vernon. If there's something you're dying to tell us or get off your chest, let's hear it. Ping us a quick email to song at radiomountvernon.org.uk. Next up, the Human League. This is Radio Mount Vernon. Great song, Hadaway, from 1992. Songs coming up. 
we've got ABC, The Faces, and Ja Rule all coming up. More great music next, The Human League. Radio Mount Vernon, Tuesday afternoon, so glad you could join us today. Hope you're enjoying the Tuesday tunes. Playing next, from 1982, The Human League. You're listening to Radio Mount Vernon. Four minutes to three. Check out our Facebook page on the web. Head to facebook.com forward slash Radio Mount Vernon. Next up, how about this? From 1985, Kajagoogoo. You're listening to Radio Mount Vernon. Four minutes to three. OK, bookmark the Radio Mount Vernon website on your internet browser thingy. Head to www.radiomountvernon.org.uk. There's loads of info on all the shows there. Stand by for a great song from 1985. Kajagoogoo. Hadaway from 1992. Three minutes to three. Afternoon time here. Can we sneak in a little siesta, do you think? Will anyone notice? A sneaky Tuesday kip? Time to chill for a moment. Relax. Nice deep breaths from 1985. Peebo Bryson and Roberta Flack. <laughs> 